In 2012, the Italian manufacturer of sports cars, Pagani, launched the first car in the Huayra series, being at the time the lightest supercar in its class. The launch of this model was not at all simple, the Huayra being on the design table for five years. After many 3D models and many prototypes, the Huayra was ready for testing. And because it was named after a wind god called Huayra Tata, the car could not be called a supercar, but rather a hypercar. Under the hood, the Huayra hides a twin-turbo 6-liter V12 engine developed by Mercedes-AMG specifically for it, and it was limited to just 100 units as part of the agreement between Pagani and engine supplier Mercedes-AMG. The Huayra could accelerate to 100 km an hour in less than 3.5 seconds, offering a maximum speed of 360 km an hour. Thus, the Pagani Huayra was named Hypercar of the Year 2012 by Top Gear magazine. The body was built from carbon fiber and titanium, and the exterior has influences from Pagani Zonda, presenting charismatic details from premium materials. The interior is quite opulent and high-tech, with an aluminum central console and touchscreen for the infotainment system, which controls the audio functions and satellite navigation. The next model, the Huayra BC, was presented in 2016 at the Geneva Motor Show and bore the initials of Benny Caiola, a friend of Horacio Pagani and Pagani's first customer. Until that moment, the Huayra BC was the most advanced and innovative Huayra Coupe both from a technological point of view and from the point of view of the changes made. The performance was greater this time, thanks to the material used, called Carbon Triax. It is 50% lighter and 20% stronger than carbon fiber. And together with a 750 horsepower and 6 liter twin turbo V12 engine, the hypercar offered both high performance and comfort. So, the interior looks spectacular, the color palette is superb, combining carbon fiber and red accents. The exterior is even more impressive. All the elements and exterior lines of the car are spectacular. The front part is layered in fins, spoilers, flaps, and headlights that integrate perfectly into the design. The rear is superb, especially with the massive spoiler across the entire width of the car. Initially, Pagani promised to produce only 20 units of the Huayra BC, which sold out immediately, but Pagani actually produced 30 units, upsetting some owners. In 2017, at the Geneva Motor Show, Pagani presented the new Huayra with a cut roof called Roadster. Only 100 units were produced, which sold out immediately. Again, Pagani used the lightest materials, making the Huayra Roadster lighter than the first coupe, only at 1,280 kilograms. Because it's called a Roadster, the most obvious change was obviously the removable cover. There are additional air vents at the front and rear, especially on the humps about the engine, and the exhaust has a new design. The wheels are unique and specially built for this model, and new stitching patterns were used for the interior and different themes and colors were available. The car also has conventional doors instead of Coupe's gullwing doors, as they were impossible to fit on a convertible. Under the hood, the Huayra Roadster is equipped with the Mercedes-AMG 12-cylinder engine, delivering 764 HP with over 1,000 Newton meters of torque. After two years, Pagani also launched the BC Limited edition of the Roadster model. Compared to the standard Roadster model, the BC has a much more aggressive, sporty appearance. As Pagani used to, this model is also built from very light materials, making it 30 kilograms lighter than its standard version. New for this model was a set of exhaust flaps that will move some of the exhaust down under and over the sides of the car diffuser like a Formula One car. Next, Pagani collaborated with Mercedes-AMG, which designed a twin-turbo V12 developing 802 horsepower. Production of the Huayra Roadster BC was limited to just 40 units. In 2019, Pagani launched the Huayra Imola model, named after the Autodormo Internazionale Enzo di Dino Ferrari circuit, known as Imola. At that time, it was the most powerful version of the Huayra, being powered by a Mercedes-AMG V12 engine developing 827 horsepower. As a design, Imola presents aggressive sport elements with a larger diffuser with seven sections, a shark fin, more accentuated side sills, and a very wide rear spoiler. Pagani built only six Imola examples. In 2021, Pagani launched the Huayra R, a track-only version of the series. 
The Huayra R exudes sportiness from all angles and uses both the classic design and high-tech elements and materials. The design and engine of the Huayra R was inspired by the Le Mans prototype of the Golden Era, and every line and surface above and below the Pagani Huayra R was designed to generate very good aerodynamics. The Huayra R uses the Pagani V12R, a version of the Mercedes-Benz's naturally aspirated 6-liter, built from scratch by HWA AG to produce 850 horsepower. The engine, designed by Hans Werner of Rech, is extremely powerful and is the lightest engine in the category on the planet, weighing only 198 kilograms. The car is built on a monocoque chassis made of carbo-titanium and carbo-triax. With alloy steel subframes, this makes the entire car weigh just 1,050 kilograms. The Huayra R was limited to just 30 units. Inspired by the style of the golden ages of sports cars, Pagani presented a new Huayra model in 2022, this time with the long tail. Only five models will exist, and the price starts at $7.4 million. Cotalunga comes with an extremely simple design, but at the same time imposing and racy, and it comes without the rear wing. But as spectacular as the exterior is, it is just as beautiful inside, where the leather blends perfectly with the aluminium or carbon fiber elements. The Pagani still uses Mercedes-Benz's twin-turbo 6-liter V12, which produces 829 horsepower. It's backed by a 7-speed extract sequential transmission for true race-inspired performance and weighs just 1,280 kilograms.